Chances are you may be juggling thousands of things as a brand owner and you may be wondering how to get more sales for your efforts. Well, I got you covered because in this video, we're gonna be diving into how you could be spending five minutes a day selling your brand with AI and email marketing. Let's go. First things first, what is email marketing? Well, email marketing is a great way to maintain relationships with people that have come across your brand. By creating and fostering that relationship, you turn that lead into a customer. These can be leads that you get either in person or people that are shopping or thinking of shopping for your brand online. And the best part about email marketing is that you don't need to be a guru and you don't need to be that tech savvy because we're gonna be showing you guys some really easy hacks. And step one is to build your email list because you need a list of customers to market and sell to. And in order to do this, consider creating a sign-up form that exchanges value of some kind. It could be either a one-time discount or it could be like entering to a free giveaway. Get creative with what you're going to be offering in order for somebody to sign up to your list. Because once you start getting that list in there, it's all about marketing and we're gonna be talking about that more in this video. But once you do have that sign-up form, another key strategy that you should consider is to actually take that URL and create a QR code with it. That way, anytime that you're out and about, somebody comments on what you're wearing, you can say, hey, join my email list, scan this, enter it. We actually have like a monthly giveaway or you have that exchange of value. And another thing that you wanna do is you also wanna promote that sign-up form on social media. Make sure it's a part of your link in bio so people know, hey, get 10% off or enter free giveaways. You wanna always be promoting this list because the more people you get into it, the higher the chances of somebody buying. Now, in order to accomplish this, you're gonna need an email marketing platform. And I highly encourage that you check out OmniSend who made this video possible. Now, I gotta be completely transparent here, guys. OmniSend is one of the easiest email marketing platforms to use if you're selling on e-commerce. There's so many different options available out there, but OmniSend truly has streamlined the process to make creating sign-up forms, segmenting your list, and automating everything super simple. So if you haven't already, started your subscription make sure you guys check out the links in the description down below because it's free you guys can literally sign up start doing everything that we're going to be discussing and regardless if you're using OmniSend or if you're using a different marketing platform the tools and the things that we're about to share in this video are still going to apply and the next step is to create a newsletter now a newsletter is the marketing and brand message that you're putting out to your leads to help convert them into customers now the goals for creating a newsletter is to get them to open the email and then it has to be eye-catching enough for them to want to read or scroll and then more importantly click on the offer that you have those will be the metrics that will dictate whether you're creating a successful newsletter or not but it doesn't matter how eye-catchy or beautifully designed it is if nobody opens it up and this is where creating subject lines with ai comes into play now even two years ago i was paying people to write subject lines and email campaigns and with chat gpt it completely changed the game because with chat gpt you're able to actually start creating subject lines and the beauty about it is that you can now take those subject lines and test them on omnisense email marketing platform unless you know exactly how email subject lines are written chances are this is always going to be something you're testing but with this tool in hand you're able to actually verify that hey this has a pretty good score or what can I do to improve it? Because subject lines are the one thing that people are gonna read when they open their email, guys. And with that subject line confirmed, next up is to create the visuals for the campaign. Now, when it comes to creating visuals, a tool such as Kittle allows you to actually import your photos. So any of the photos that you may have taken on your phone, you can quickly upload and start removing backgrounds. And you can start selecting some of the templates that are on there for marketing to create calls to actions for the products that you're selling. Now, they also include a variety of different libraries that you can choose from to craft a newsletter and then actually insert those assets into OmniSend. So I highly encourage that you guys check out that platform so you guys can start playing around and really enhancing the visuals. Because when it comes to email marketing, the visual design is everything and it's what makes people stay subscribed. Because if you're just sending out some very basic things, people are eventually not gonna find any value in it. So make sure that you guys elevate your branding, elevate your products and elevate your photography. Because once you do have the visual assets, you can actually bring them right into OmniSend and start building out the campaign. Now, I highly encourage that you put a personal touch to the emails that you send out. Remind people of how they might have come across you or what the importance is of why they're receiving this. Especially when it comes to doing sales, you always want to connect the products and the designs that you're selling to that customer. So OmniSend allows you to do this by easily inserting text blocks, headlines, and other assets that you need to make this visually appealing. 
And most importantly, make sure that you have strong call to actions throughout the email campaign. Somewhere at the bottom, somewhere in between, and somewhere along the top. You wanna to have different touch points, so even if they don't look at the entire email, subconsciously, they might just wanna click on something and see what you have to offer. And with the campaigns completed, we move on to the next step, which is in scheduling and automation. Once you accomplish all the foundational work, this is where spending five minutes a day to schedule it out for the rest of the week comes in handy, because you can actually build out all your email campaigns to send out in advance. Now, the beauty about OmniSend is that they have a couple of different ways you can automate triggers. They have welcome series, so as you're building a welcome campaign, it'll easily automate to send the next email if somebody opens it, if they don't open it, and it could literally trigger multiple touch points. The goal for email marketing is for you to put in the upfront work to have residual sales coming in. A lot of times people think about email marketing as a one-time send, and if they don't get the results, they're disappointed and they stop doing it. So I want you to shift the mindset and I want you to start building out the campaign that's gonna be a welcome series and an abandoned cart series. You wanna have a welcome series so whenever anybody signs up to your list, they're actually receiving a series of emails. Even if they don't purchase something, they're learning more about your brand. And then when it comes to abandoned carts, make sure that you're sending the product that they left in the cart and then bring them back with another series there. Because once those two series are programmed, they run on autopilot. They'll automatically send even when you're sleeping. So it's not a waste of time to build out those campaigns. And once they are built out, you built out a muscle that now you can start to easily write, craft, and design emails so you're able to send out new ones every single week. The goal is to start this muscle with just five minutes a day. It's not gonna be something that you build overnight, but you gotta just spend five minutes a day building the different steps and you'll be on a way better solid foundation than most brands are. And last but not least, you're gonna wanna analyze the content that you're sending out. This is why it's important to create emails and send out to your list because now you'll have real data. You'll know what the open rates are, what the click-through rates are, and how many of those messages potentially went to spam. You need to be able to have these metrics so you can improve things every single month. Oftentimes people fail to do this and then they wonder why the emails aren't working. You gotta begin by sending out, scheduling out, and then looking at the data and making adjustments. Should the email subject lines be changed? Should the content of the email campaign be completely different? Should the messaging be different? Using the analytical tools that OmniSend gives you allows you to analyze exactly what's happening within your email marketing. And the beauty about this is that if it's not working, sometimes you just gotta survey out your audience. Create an easy survey form that allows them to say, hey, I wanna know more about how I can better serve you and give me some real honest feedback. By getting those surveys back, you're able to make adjustments in real time and improve the open rates, click-through rates, and your overall sales. And there you have it guys, with just five minutes a day, you can start to build a foundation for your brand and start making sales on autopilot. Now to be completely honest here guys, this is probably one of the most overlooked things that new brand owners make. They don't spend the time to do this and then they wonder why they're not getting consistent sales. Now, you may be wondering what is a good metric for if you have a good email list and if your strategy is on the right track. As a catch-all, a dollar per lead is the metric that you should be shooting for. If you got a thousand person a newsletter, you should be making $1,000 a month. If you got five, it should be five. If you got 10, it should be 10. And that's a metric you should be using because the closer you get to that dollar number, it tells you that you're up there competing with the big brands. But we all start at zero dollars, guys. All right, so don't beat yourself up. You just gotta get started. And sometimes we overthink it and we really think that it's a lot more difficult than it needs to be. And some of the tools that we may come across are very confusing and they bring us down, which is really the reason why I champion what OmniSend is doing for new entrepreneurs because they truly are for small to medium-sized brands. The way that they onboard their workflows and the way that they allow you to really build your brand over time is truly a game changer. So I highly encourage that you guys check them out in the links in the description. We also included all the different resources that we mentioned throughout this video in the links below. And if this is the first time you're watching and you took some value from this, hit that subscribe button and turn on those post notifications for future video releases. And if you're looking to expand your collection or maybe launch a new one, in a recent video, we launched a brand new collection from start to finish in seven days with less than $100. And if you're interested in watching that one, click here and I'll see you there.